Nearly a dozen army schools in the Jammu region have been shut as a precautionary measure amid a high alert in Jammu and Kashmir after the Rajouri attack in which five soldiers died. Now this comes ahead of the third G20 tourism working group meeting which will be held in Kashmir between the 22nd and the 24th of May. My colleague Neeta Sharma gets us more details. You know, after the Rajouri encounter, schools, almost half a dozen of them, have been asked to uh, close their uh, premises and now classes are being held for the students online because uh, what we are learning from our sources that combing operations are still going on in Rajouri and Poonch area and that is why these schools have been asked to uh, remain closed because they don't want to put any kind of, uh, uh, they don't want to create any kind of problem for the students who are going to study there and interestingly you know uh, when, when I spoke to some of the school uh, administration uh, people also they were also saying that the schools have been shut and these schools are shut till uh, May 25th. The, this G20 uh, working group uh, committee meetings are scheduled to take place from May 22nd to May 24th in Srinagar. Massive security arrangements are taking place. Both Jammu and Kashmir are on the highest state of alert uh, right now. Uh, what uh, we are also learning that the venues are going to be guarded by the National Security Guard and also uh, special forces have been flown from Jammu region to uh, Kashmir to Srinagar area where they would be guarding the visiting uh, dignitaries. Uh, interestingly, you know, uh, the presence of uh, uh, the, the, the terrorists who were there for last one year or so. Our sources are telling us that foreign terrorists, about 30, or 30 odd of them, have been reactivated by Pakistan. Uh, senior officers tell that they have been supplied arms and ammunition, also grenades. Uh, so the maximum number of threat is from the vehicle bone IED, what we saw in Poonch area also, VBID. So uh, the, the forces have been asked to keep uh, asked to keep a watch on VBIDs and also uh, the presence of terrorists in, in northern part of Kashmir. That is also a big uh, worrying trend for the security forces. So wholesome efforts are being made. The Union Home Secretary was there for two consecutive days. Yesterday also he did a big review in the police headquarters in Jammu, in Kashmir region. So all efforts are out. More forces on on the ground are there uh, to keep everyone safe and to make ensure that the G20 meet passes on peacefully.